Hey everyone, welcome back to Bullion RV. My name is Gabe Loosman. Today I'm going to be showing you the 2022 Arctic Wolf 23 pack 15 toy hauler. So here we have it. We're going to take you around the outside, take you through the inside, show you the garage, show you all the amenities, and you guys are going to have to let me know what you think. So let's get started. We've got the power jack here in the front, two 20 pound propane tanks. You got your battery power hookup. Here's the reservoir for your would be generator. This one does not have one, obviously. So you have your exterior shower hookup and station. Your spray port, fresh water. Cable satellite plug ins over here. Your furnace exhaust, your hot water heater. There you will have your power port for your detachable plug-in. And then this ramp will fold down to either the ground so you can unload your toys that you're hauling. Or you can leave the cables attached and it'll sit level as a patio with a railing. So you got your leash latch for the best friend. You got your fuel pump and your fuel reservoir. Your pump controls are right here. You've got controls for your power stabilizing jacks. Dual axle. You got your TV mount and TV prep sites right here so you can have your game plan on the outside, under the awning. You got the accent lights on the arms there. Another leash latch, depending on what you got out here, you don't want the dog getting mixed up into the toys over there. Put them on the leash latch right there. All right. You also, over here, you got your pass, or not pass through storage, but your storage well. So this is the hose that'll plug into your spray port. You got the spigot on it, your detachable power cable, and then tie downs in here in your storage area. Your solar charge controller right there. Nice sturdy steps to go all the way down to the pavement. No bounce. You got a handle right here to grab hold of. So the dry weight of this is 7,928 pounds. You can see your garage space is right there. You've got tie down latches all the way back to right in front of the sink here in the kitchen. So you can actually utilize this whole space to put toys. And then it comes with two recliner chairs, recliner leather armchairs here. So you can situate those however you'd like to. And then you have the two couches here that are fold down. And then up top, you have your bed that you can lower down. So, and then you would have your ramp go down to a patio there, fold out these railings, and then you have a nice area to sit and enjoy the campsite. So here's your kitchen. So the whole slide on this unit is a kitchen. You've got your fridge and freezer combo right here. So then you got your multi-air flow freezer. And your multi-air flow fridge. So that's quite a bit of space in there. Fairly decent amount of counter space. And of course you'll recover some counter space. You got the glass cover for your three burner stove top. Dual purpose backsplash and cutting board. Range hood. And then a microwave above all of that. Oh, can't forget about the Greystone oven. So you got cabinetry down below. That's good sized. And then you got some nice drawers over here. To store any utensils or towels or 
extra items you can think of that you can't put up or don't want to put up here and so you can put some plates bowls and cups up here your tv is going to go right there so then your tv will be facing the rest of the room so you can set that up accordingly if you'd like to and then maybe get the private stock right in here in this corner cabinet here are your tank controls so you get a reading whether it's empty full or half or third or two-thirds rather and you got your GFCI protect outlet your cover over your sink you get the restaurant style faucet soap dispenser and then storage underneath thermostat so you get the ventilation opening for the toy hauler so you don't have any gas fumes in here all right oh definitely can't do that out you got a lot of cupboard space here above the awning side or on the top of the wall on the awning side rather you got a stereo system with Bluetooth AM FM USB plug-in nice big window overlooking your campsite let's move on to the bathroom your medicine cabinet now there is quite a bit of space in this bathroom walk in turn around easily so you get the foot pedal flush and then a tall shower here as well good size We'll check out the master bedroom now. The master bedroom is very nice with the storage. You've got overhead storage. You've got the hanging storage with each one having a mirror. So you can see your hanging storage. You can put some things on the floor in there as well. You got the bedside area, big enough to put a CPAP if you have one of those or or anything that you want to have close by the Kindle the iPad whatever you guys are thinking you know there you are so here you got your battery engage and disengage switch and then your fuse box or panel breaker panel so you got outlet on each side TV prepper up in the corner on the ceiling right there so you can mount the TV on the wall right below that all right so you know like we said before recap quick this garage space can be as big as you need it to be so if you've got side-by-side -side, UTV a few dirt bikes, a couple four-wheelers, you know, whatever it is that your adventure sport needs to accommodate or your trailer needs to accommodate for your adventure sport, you know, this is going to be a good unit to pick from just by the amount of space and tie-down latches that there are. So if you guys have more questions about any of these units, feel free to give me a call. My number is 218-428-7629. Here you have the 2022 23-pack-15 toy hauler by Arctic Wolf. And let us know down in the comments what you liked, what you didn't like, what you want to learn about next. So have a great day, guys. Thank you. Gabe Luthman, Luth, Minnesota, Bullion RV.